The Drive with Tim Donnelly here on 99.9 The Fan, joined by senior linebacker from Miami, the U, Francisco Maui Goa. Uh, Francisco, thank you very much for, for taking the time. Um, I grew up in Hawaii, so I know a little bit about the the, the Polynesian culture and, and everything going on there. You grew up in, in Samoa? Yeah. Uh, what food do you miss most? Oh, there's a lot, man. I, I miss the Luau, Luau PP. It's a turkey, turkey uh, wrapped in uh, uh, taro leaves with, with coconut milk and onions in it. It's really good. Uh, you, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it sounds good. Uh, the other thing I know about Polynesian culture, is, especially in football, is there's there's a loyalty, there's there's a brotherhood that that's going on there. Mm-hmm. Give us your your Polynesian football goat. Who's 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 the best? I think any Polynesian football player would say Troy Polamalu. Mm. He's 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 one of them guys that you know kind of set the standard. My producer's a Steelers fan, so so yeah, as soon as, so as soon as that about. was said, Steelers mm. fan? No, I'm not. A Steelers oh, okay. Fan, just Troy, Troy Polamalu. Polamalu. I'm a Troy Polamalu all right. fan. Uh, <laughs> all right, so so you're you're playing linebacker. Uh, obviously, Polamalu is safety, but uh, but some of that that the, those instincts and everything does that come through? Yeah, I mean, uh, if you see Troy Polamalu and the way he played, very instinctive and. He's very aggressive, mm. um, and and I think that's kind of what I see and kind of form and shape my game too, was just how he played the game, and um, you, you can just see the intensity that he plays the game, and any defensive player would you know would, would look at it at the mm. same way. So yeah, Francisco Maui Goa, senior linebacker, Miami, connecting with us here at ACC kickoff in Charlotte on the drive. Uh, growing up in Samoa, did you uh, did did. My, the, like the you and what Miami was, did that make it out there? Or are you experiencing all this for the first time? Um, to be honest, I never like I would watch the Miami Hurricanes, but it wasn't um as a big of a deal to me when I was young <laughs> until you know I made the transition to you know college football, knowing what college football is all about, and just seeing different schools. That's when I realized you know the Miami Hurricanes is Miami Hurricanes, and if you look back in the history of it, like defense is you know they're pretty much known of how you know aggressive and how great these guys played and fly around the ball so yeah. right, well, i'll ask that same question who's the miami hurricanes goat Ooh, ray lewis all right i th- i say ray lewis so, so we got a Steeler, we got a raven we're playing, we're playing both sides <laughs> both sides of all of it uh um let's look at a a, a different deal there right because you grow up in, in Samoa you end up playing in Washington State yeah. uh, are you tipping everybody off on what Cal's bringing because you, you're, you're the Pac-12 and, and you understand what what football they're bringing onto your schedule this year I mean I always love playing Cal I played Cal t- uh, twice um when I was at Washington State and you know they, they bring a lot to the to the table um I think they got a really good team this year and you know I'm excited to play them again. <laughs> uh, the other thing that's that's fascinating. Your, your younger brother was a starter on the offense, or uh, yeah, on the offensive line for mm-hmm. for Miami as a freshman this past year. You know, Five star recruit, big big deal. Uh, but I read an article that said coach doesn't shy away from putting you guys against each other in drills. Who's winning those battles? Oh, uh, I say fifty fifty. Really? Yeah. The you know, bigger he's, brother he's, saying fifty fifty. I yeah, say that's 50-50. very very humble uh, of you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's been working a lot to be where he's at right now. Uh, he has the will to, you know, get better every single day and just have the grit to, you know, just work towards his dream of, you know, being a step ahead of everybody. Uh, and, and and are you passing on tips, right? You, you've seen everything that a linebacker can do to, to trip up a, an offensive lineman at the second level. What are those conversations like? I mean, every time we just kind of critique each other um, after practices, uh, we watch film and just critiquing each other, um, telling each other, like, what, you know, the type of stance that you 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 do that take uh you know that tells this play in certain plays or if i'm you know showing a a, a certain way that you know that tells i'm blitzing so all those goes into it uh just being able to critique each other to you know to to gain more confidence in playing the game of football we're, we're here at ACC kickoff, and one of the players I keep getting asked about is, is your teammate Cam Ward mm-hmm. and and what he brings to the table. As somebody that's gone up against him in practice, what can you tell us about his game? Cam Ward is a game changer. Um, there's a reason why a lot of guys wanted – a lot of teams wanted Cam Ward was the way he carried himself and the type of leader he is. And him coming to the Miami Hurricanes, when he first stepped in the locker room, he, you could just feel his presence. Um, he's, he's a great guy off the field, a great leader that will – you know, not only because you can see leader and 
um, would shy away from it, but this guy goes to it. Mm. Um, he is um, always about the players, always about the teammates, always around the teammates, playing something, playing football or, or playing basketball or on the game playing. But that's that's all part of it. Like it builds so much into this team, um, having to have that leader that has that spot to, you know, get everybody connected. Can, can he hoop? I think he can hoop. I, I've seen I've seen him hoop at Washington State. He can hoop. He can throw. All right. And uh, shoot, yeah. last question. This question is every year at ACC kickoff. You has, have to ask it of the, the Miami guys. Uh, is Miami back? I say Miami's back. All right. <laughs> <laughs> wouldn't, wouldn't expect much else from the players from Miami. Uh, Francisco, we appreciate you for taking the time. Uh, good luck this season. I appreciate that. Thank you.